you uh, hear it rain. It's raining pretty hard right now. Uh, when it's raining like this, it sort of gets me in the mood to it either doesn't or does gets me in the mood to make a video. But you know, you ever wonder why there's some things in life you can remember per pretty vividly, and there's some things in life that you cannot. For for example, I can remember 1965. I was two years old. And I can remember our so-called mean neighbors. Now my dad says they wasn't mean. They just drunk a lot. I guess they loved their beer. But I can remember them. Here we uh, we lived on Smith Road here in Goshen, Claremont County, and uh, Cedar Pay Lake. Uh, I think it's uh, go down, uh, go down the hill and up the hill. Is that house with a sharp roof and that garage my dad built anyway my uncle Clifton owned that my dad's brother and my dad rented it from him my uncle Clifton had worked at Ford by that time I, th I think my uncle Clifton worked at Ford probably about eight years but we rented we stayed there I guess about a year and I can remember a little bit uh, of uh, I think I guess it was sled riding down the hill in the back of the house. But what I really remember is those mean, so-called mean neighbors. And I can I can actually still remember them standing around me. Now comprehend this: I was only two years old. 1965 I was only two years old but I can rem remember those neighbors around me per pretty vividly ain't that amazing yet that same year go across the road to Cedar Pay Lake I do not remember going fishing with my dad he would put me on top of his shoulders and take me over there and uh, go fishing uh, I, rem I remember on being on his shoulders, but I do not remember a bit, not a bit of Cedar Pay Lake. Ain't that incredible? But I remember those mean neighbors. Now, why is that? I was reading an article. Scientists are trying to figure that out. Why is that? I can remember those neighbors, and I was only two years old. I can remember them. 1965. But I, I do not remember going over to Cedar Pay Lake with my dad. I remember 1968 because my dad was making my Uncle Carl, who passed away, a homemade tombstone. And I can still see my dad with a piece of wood in his hand carving the flowers into the uh a concrete he just poured. The concrete hadn't dried yet. And like I said, he was making a tombstone. And I can still see my dad carving those flowers. I was five years old then. And I remember playing with balloons at my sister's birthday party. We got that on Home Movie, 1969. Why is it some things we can remember and some things we cannot? It just shows you the flaws in our brains. Ain't that incredible when you think about it? Some things I remember very, very, very clear. And those neighbors from 1965, me two years old, I remember, I remember being scared of them. I remember them walking or standing by me. That's incredible when you think about that. Our brains.